In the tapestry of life, perseverance weaves the threads of resilience, faith, and determination. As a Christian, we find unparalleled guidance and encouragement in the Holy Scriptures on how to navigate the storms of life with unwavering perseverance. Scripture teaches us that perseverance is not merely enduring hardships, but it's about pressing on with hope and faith, trusting in God's promises despite the trials. In Romans 5 3-4, we're reminded that perseverance produces character, and character, hope. This verse illuminates the transformative power of perseverance, molding us into vessels of hope in the darkest of times. The story of Job exemplifies perseverance in the face of adversity. Despite losing his possessions, health, and family, Job remained steadfast in his faith, declaring, Though he slay me, yet will I hope in him, Job 13 15. Job's unwavering trust in God's sovereignty amidst suffering teaches us that true perseverance is rooted in unshakable faith. Moreover, the life of Jesus embodies the epitome of perseverance. From enduring temptation in the wilderness to facing crucifixion, Jesus never wavered in fulfilling His divine purpose. Hebrews 12 2 urges us to fix our eyes on Jesus, the pioneer and perfecter of faith, drawing strength from His example as we run the race of life with perseverance. As Christians, we are called to emulate the perseverance of Christ and the saints who have gone before us. In the midst of trials, let us anchor ourselves in prayer, cling to God's promises, and draw strength from the fellowship of believers. Remember, let us not become weary in doing good, for at the proper time we will reap a harvest if we do not give up, Galatians 6 9. In conclusion, perseverance is not merely enduring hardships, but it's about persevering with purpose, faith, and hope. Let us embrace the challenges of life with unwavering perseverance, knowing that through Christ, we are more than conquerors. For a better experience, please watch the full version of this video. Each short has a long version.